Peekaboo. What's up guys, it's Daniel the Vape Man here. I'm excited. I have some good news. Finally got my mask RDA. I have it. it I'm testing it out before I put it on my lipo. So I put it on the Legend and it actually fits. It does go over the USB. Uh, but I needed way more power for these insane coils that I got made by uh, NIDAR. Uh, I think that's how you pronounce his name. I will put a link on Instagram and do a little video tomorrow once I try more of his coils. I've tried a bunch of them. Really nice guy. Really good coils by him. Uh, but yeah, we're going to get to together and then I'll have a link where you can buy it from him. He only does made to order, no mass productions or anything like that. But this is my 30 millimeter on the RX300 and as you can barely see it has a little bit, I would say a millimeter overhang. But I needed 150 watts um, because this coil is a beast. So, it's perfect for the mass RDA. I'm testing it out just before I put it on the lipo to make sure I like it. But, without further ado, what I'm vaping on right now, basic series, butternut, butter, butternut, I always say butternut, butter, <laughs> butternut, no, butterscotch reserve, and as it, it's a 7030 BG, as all of them are from the basic series. This is a butterscotch, an RY, for tobacco and a caramel. So let's drip it. And let's find out how it is. Even though I already know how it is. So, right down the middle goes to the well. I think it has something like a ridiculous like 11 millimeter well. I don't know what it is, but let's give it a go. So, uh, this is my first tobacco flavor. I was very, I thought it was going to be crappy, uh, honestly, because I've never had a tobacco flavor. It's actually really good. You definitely get a little bit of that butternut, a little bit of uh, that caramel, and a little bit of the woodiness or whatever of tobacco, but nothing that overpowers it or um, does anything. You know, it, 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 it's a really good flavor. I actually really dig it. Uh, I've been vaping on it on and off for the last couple of days and I am really happy with it. Absolutely love it. So let's give it a couple rips and do the mimication, make it quick. Coil Ooh, it's a little hot. Ran dry already. Yeah, this thing gets dry pretty quick. So anyways, let's do the mimictation before I drip some new flavor to try out. So the mimictation on it, I mean, I, it's my first tobacco flavor, so we're going to get rid of that. We'll just do the butternut, the butter squash, the butter scotch and the caramel, which is pretty accurate. I would say it's an 85. For the tobacco, I need to expand my tongue a little bit more as I am with menthols. I'm about to dabble into this liquid that I got a sample of. It is Mega Rush Mango, and it's on ice. So I've been dipping in the menthols, and now I'm trying to get into the tobaccos. Uh, so I would say it's an 80-85% off of that and overall right now I'd say it's an 88.5. I absolutely love it. It's not my favorite of all time, but I do love it. So anyways, check them out. Links are down below to their website. You can find some really good deals for them right now. They only have 60 millimeters, but milliliters. I can't speak today. But yeah, check them out. That has been Butter Scotch. Reserve not butter, not that fucking anything besides that. It's just butter, not it's butterscotch reserve. For once, I'm gonna say it right. So let's 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 remix it. So that has been butterscotch reserve. I did it. I did it. Yes, 
I am the man. I did it. it. Took me 47 tries, but I finally got it. Anyways, please like and subscribe for more video content. I will have a ton. I'll do an in-depth review on the mask. Love the look of it, by the way. Anonymous. Uh, check me out on Instagram, Daniel the Bateman, Daniel under slash the under slash Bateman, and baffled Daniel the Bateman, all one word. Uh, yeah, so stay tuned for more. And we have a bunch of stuff. I have my second sample box coming, as you know, and a bunch of other stuff coming. Chronicles should be here in two weeks, hopefully sooner. But anyways, y'all have a good night. See you soon.